Kathy Lynch Kabuzi was never allowed to ask her grandmother about the Titanic, but the stories trickled down through the generations. There she is. Bridget McDermott was in third class, but coming from a poor Irish village, it was luxury, real linens, and plenty to eat. She was asleep after a night of dancing when a crew member sounded the alarm. McDermott climbed to the deck in her pajamas. And then her mother's words rang in her head, you are a lady, and a lady is not a lady without her hat and gloves. She ran back for her hat, then jumped into a lifeboat where she was shocked to find men dressed as women to save themselves. It frightened her. A century later, the tragedy is being remembered on both sides of the Atlantic. In New York, this cruise ship is setting sail with 440 passengers heading to the exact spot where the ship went down. It's a fantasy come true for the Castanetas who plan to dress the part. That was a time period in America where things were going really well, things were very grand, um, the ladies were beautiful. Every night here in the ship's dining room, one dish from the original Titanic menu will be served. All of the courses are from first class. Kathy Kabuzi will also cross the Atlantic for a ceremony in her grandmother's tiny hometown. Adderghoul lost 11 people on the Titanic. I feel like it's a little immortality for her bringing it back, although she may say, quiet, don't talk about it. She'll be in church on Sunday to remember the strong lady with the blue eyes and brogue. Manuel Gallegas, CBS News, New York.